Hello and welcome to Veed. My name is Alec and over the next couple of minutes I'm going to be showing you around Veed. Veed is an online video editor designed to help you create professional video content straight from within your browser. So let's begin with some of the basics. First of all, below me you can see the timeline. This is where you have the play and pause button. If you click this you'll pause me and I'll stop talking. And in the timeline you can also trim and split your clips. To trim your clips, all you have to do is hover over either extremity of the clip and then just click and drag to adjust it. If you want to trim part off the end, hover over the end, click and drag. If you want to split a video in the middle, so you want to cut it into two separate clips, all you have to do is select the video that you want to split, place the playhead where you want it to be cut and then click on the split button, which is at the top left of your timeline. Once you've split your clip, if there's a section of your video that you want to remove, you can either right click on that clip and then press delete, or you can just select it and hit delete on your keyboard. If you want to add more videos to your timeline to create a video compilation, you can do so by clicking on the add video button. Next, I'm going to be talking about your toolbar. Your toolbar is to the left of your screen, and this is where we can find all the tools to create professional video content. With the toolbar, we can do some of the basics of video editing, such as adding text to video, adding an image, or overlaying some sound, and we can also achieve some of the more complex tasks, such as using the chroma key tool to remove the green screen from our video. We can also automatically add subtitles to our video, just like the ones you can see on the screen right now. Now, speaking of subtitles, if you click on the subtitle tab right now, you can go into our subtitle editor, and this is where you can edit all of the text and timings of our subtitles. These subtitles were automatically generated using Veed's auto subtitle tool, meaning that I didn't have to type out any of this manually myself. And if you don't like the placement of the subtitles, all you have to do is just click and drag and then place them anywhere you want on the video canvas. And if you want to customize the style of your subtitles, for example, you might want to change the font or the color, to do so, all you have to do within the subtitle editor to my left is click on the style tab, and here you can change the font size, the font, the layout, the font color, and you can even add some drop shadow. Now, one of the best things about Veed is that you can quickly and easily create videos for multiple different social media platforms. For an example, I am currently the 16 by nine aspect ratio. If you want to post a video to YouTube, the 16 by nine aspect ratio is best. But let's say we don't want to post this video to YouTube and we want to post it to Instagram. Instagram is best known for its square videos, which have the one by one aspect ratio. So if I want to quickly and easily change this aspect ratio to the one by one aspect ratio, if I click on the project tab in the left toolbar, I go into the size drop down menu, I can choose among a bunch of different preset aspect ratios for different social media platforms. So if you go ahead and select the square one by one aspect ratio, I should now be a square video. Now, on top of all of this, there's still a lot more that you can do with Veed. You can add a bunch of filters and effects. You can add a bunch of shapes. You can also draw on your video and much, much more. But I'm going to let you discover that for yourself. So why don't you go ahead and play around with Veed's online video editor. Once you've finished editing your video, all you have to do is click on the export button in the top right of your screen to start rendering your project. If you want to adjust some of the export settings, go back into the project tab in the left toolbar and here you can change some of your project settings under the output tab. And that is how to edit a video using Veed's online video editor. If you have any questions or suggestions, please don't hesitate to reach out to us and we look forward to hearing from you. Happy video editing.